Up next, drawing from her life experiences, a Richmond Hill artist is painting the town not just red, but blue, yellow, and green in her first ever solo art exhibit. Michael Donnelly now brings us her story. I have a, actually a very special painting uh, to me, at least. Uh, it's a broken tire. Um, it's just a, a broken tire that I saw, and it's just... I think it's really beautiful <laughs> to me, um, but it turns out a lot of people thought that it looks like a dragon or something. Like it's actually pretty cool. Like it's because uh, most of my stuff are very colorful, and but that piece is uh, black and white, so something different. Richmond Hill artist Si Lau is living out her dream as a painter, but you would never guess that she has not had any formal training. I never really went to. Um, art school, um, but uh, I always liked art when I was a little kid and with, uh, with a new, you know, uh, immigrant family, it's, to go to art school is not something that, you know, your parents is, will encourage you to do. Um, everybody has to make a living. Um, but eventually, you know, um, my dream comes true uh, after now that I have two girls and uh, just beautiful life. <laughs> I love to use oil because uh, it, it just there's so many uh, different techniques that you can use on and um, also uh, it, the color it's so vibrant. Um, I have a wide, like very wide range of uh, subject that I like to do, from landscape, flowers, to people. Um, just as long as it speaks out to me, then I, I would like to paint it. And now, many of her paintings are on display at the Richmond Hill Center for the Performing Arts. It is her first solo exhibition. Wow. That one's really nice. I have uh, about 20 pieces there. Um, it range from um, landscape. Um, I because I travel a lot, so um, I like to uh, take pictures at uh, different countries and then uh, bring them back and uh, painted them. So I have a couple of like Venice and uh, uh, China. Um, so. And I also have a few abstract pieces, um, flowers. I like flowers a lot, as you can see. Um, so yeah, it, it has a like very big variety. Admission to the exhibit is free, but C says many of her paintings are available for sale. A portion of the proceeds will go to charity. I always wanted to do some charity work. So uh, for this exhibition, um, 10% of the proceeds will be donated to sick kids and another 10% will go to uh, Princess Margaret um, just because I have friends that they're going through you know tough times right now for cancers and fighting for cancers and all that so so I try to do whatever I can to hopefully it makes a little difference whatever I think is beautiful exactly. I, just, I just do it oh and the ones at the top too yeah I am beyond happy like um, it's it is my dream come true like when I was a kid I had two dreams one is to be a flight attendant and one is uh, to be an artist and actually both came true after I have two kids so you never know what life will take you I'm Michael Donnelly with your community connection <laughs>